What's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Detroit Lions video. Now, this morning we got a little bit of Lions news, and that news is that third round pick Julian Okora has signed to his rookie contract for the Detroit Lions. Now, before we get into it, if you are new to the channel and are enjoying the content, consider liking the videos, subscribe to the channel and sharing with a Lions fan to help me get this channel out there, help the channel grow, and just help me out. I would appreciate it greatly. But with that being said, let's get into the let's get into talking about our third round pick and Julian Okora signing his rookie contract. Now Julian Okwara was obviously the third round edge rusher out of Notre Dame. His brother Romeo Okwara is currently a Detroit Lion. Did not have a great season last year, but two years ago in 2018, he did have seven and a half sacks and was very productive for the Detroit Lions. Now, Ro or now Julian Okwara is the third rookie of this class to sign his rookie contract. The first two being John Penasini and Logan Stenberg. Julian signed to a four year, $4.93 million contract. Now, if you have not seen my channel before, you can go back and find a ton of different videos on Julian Okora and my thoughts. If you did not know, I am a Notre Dame fan, so I had the pleasure of watching him for three years at Notre Dame, or at least three productive years at Notre Dame. And in those three or in those three years, he had 79 total tackles, 15 and a half sacks, four forced fumbles, two interceptions, a fumble recovery, and 24 tackles for loss. And unfortunately, his senior season did end with a broken fibula, which is why his draft stop dropped to the third round. If he was not injured, I could definitely have seen him going in the early second, if not even the late first. And I think that this was a big steal for the Detroit Lions if he is going to remain healthy. And before the broken leg, he really didn't have any injury concerns. And from everything that I've seen, the leg is healing very well, and he seems to be on a track to recovery very very quickly and very you know everything's going well as far as recovery for him now i think that he's going to take over this divine canard role that was left obviously when the detroit lions cut divine canard why they did it i don't know probably they say you know as far as everything i've seen a caps thing but he really wasn't taking up that much money in my opinion you know as and he was a leader he was a team captain last season i think the last two seasons he led the team in sacks or was tied for it with seven tied with trey flowers but I think Julian O'Quara can come in and put up very similar stats as a rookie. He's more athletic than Devon Kennard, not quite as technically refined. But if there's any coach in the NFL that's going to teach you technique and how to be a clean player, it's going to be Matt Patricia. And I think he can mold that athleticism into, and I think he can refine Julian's skills to make him a very good pass rusher to help him out. And obviously, I mentioned that Julian's brother Romeo is on the team. That sibling rivalry is going to push both of them to be, both of them to be better. Now, if you don't have a sibling, everything is a competition. You want to be better than your sibling at everything, even if it's a stupid thing. You just want to be better at them at everything and just be the best sibling. So I think that sibling rivalry is going to push the brothers to be better. I think it's going to push each one to, you know, be better than they would be if they were on separate teams. And I think that that is the reason we picked him is because his brother is here. It's going to push him to be better. It's going to push Romeo to be better. And they're going to teach and learn off of each other. So I think that is why we picked him. I like this pick. I thought this was a fantastic pick by the Detroit Lions in the third round. We needed pass rush help. We needed to replace Devon Kennard. And I think we did that very well. Now, I don't, I'm very excited. I'm looking forward to this season starting already. I need football back in my life, live football. And I'm excited to have Julian O'Quara be our pass rusher for the next four seasons in Detroit. What do you guys think about the signing in the comments down below? What do you think about the pick? Obviously, let me know all of that. And if you have any questions, leave those down there too. But that is all I have for you guys right now. Later today, there will be a video coming out comparing the 2016 Detroit Lions playoff team to the 2020 roster as of right now. So if you are interested in seeing that, stay tuned. That will be out in a little bit. But I wanted to get this out because this is Lions news. It is rare. And I wanted to give it its moment to shine. So with that being said, that is all I have for you guys as far as Lions news today. If there is more, I will make another video. But if not, I will see all you guys later for the comparison video. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all later. Bye.